Hello, I'm Norman Swan. Welcome to another Health Minute. I can't imagine why, but some people, when they go to see the doctor, their blood pressure goes up, and when they leave the doctor's surgery, it goes down again. It's called white coat hypertension, and it can comprise nearly a quarter of people who go and see the doctor and are told their blood pressure is up. The question is whether white coat hypertension is as risky for heart attacks and strokes as having your blood pressure up all the time. That's what was asked in a study which followed 5,000 people who'd had high blood pressure diagnosed by their general practitioner. The researchers knew which ones had white coat hypertension because all these people had 24-hour blood pressures done well away from their doctors or nurses. After about seven years, the risk of dying prematurely if you had white coat hypertension was probably not much greater than the general population. So there are two main messages here. One is that if the doctor diagnoses you with high blood pressure based on the measurement in the surgery, he or she really needs to send you home on 24-hour blood pressure monitoring or taking your own blood pressure at home. Both are more accurate than measuring in the doctor's surgery. The second message is that if it's just in the surgery where your blood pressure is raised, you probably don't need medication. But that's something for you and your GP to decide between you.